Hey guys, so welcome to a new vlog. Ignore the washing behind me. I'm sat in my front room and um, well, it's, I'm just sitting here because the dining table, um, I don't have a desk in my room. <clears throat> anyway, um, so I'm vlogging today. I uploaded a second channel, uh, a video on this channel yesterday from when I'm filming this. It was just my first coffee chat video and I said how I'm going to promise myself that I'm going to start vlogging as soon as I move in to uni so I'm going to kickstart off the weekly vlogs again with the um, moving into uni vlog but I realised I kind of just decided today I'm not really doing much and I'm going to, I don't know, I guess vlogging these next, like these last few weeks of summer might help me get into the swing of it so that by the time the moving in weekend comes around I'm definitely like there's no doubt about me vlogging. I felt ill um, the Friday of Summer in the City but I didn't go until the Saturday so I was ill all Summer in the City weekend and I definitely should not have gone as hard as I did. I definitely should have sort of been in bed a lot more but obviously I didn't want to miss Summer in the City so um, <clears throat> yep and then the entire week last week after Summer in the City I was so ill like I was literally in bed I was awful I, I don't know what sort of cold it was it knocked me off my feet and usually I'm okay with cold usually I just sort of power through <clears throat> but last week it was really knocked me off my feet and it's still here so it's been here for what 10 days now it's not great today isn't particularly exciting it's oh god what time is it I think it's like 10 to 2 and I have been working all morning I just jumped out the shower that's why my hair's still damp um, I tried to air dry it like with the towel as much as possible, but sorry, there's noise outside. So yes, I'm sat at the table doing some work. So I've been coordinating all of my sort of calendars and things for the next month or so. Um, just updating things that I haven't filled in for August, so this month. But obviously it's 15th of August now, and there's a lot going on these next few weeks, it's a lot, my last few weeks of summer because I move into uni on the 9th of September so I have just over three weeks left and there's a lot to do. I had a, a thing recently, I kind of contemplated just tracking everything on one channel so you guys didn't have to jump between channels and obviously a lot of you don't really watch my second channel, probably don't even know it exists. But I decided that I just like the idea of having two channels because it's completely, um, I can just do completely different styles of things and pretty much this channel is just for doing whatever, I don't have to worry about too like meticulous editing whereas I feel like my main channel is definitely a lot more sort of well edited, like <clears throat> yeah, a little less sort of relaxed. <laughs> so I think my aim at this point, I've only sort of written this down um, for the next month or so, um, but I want to, on this channel, have sort of a chatty video like I had on Monday which is my coffee chat uh, every Monday and then every Friday hopefully every Friday I'm going to eventually have weekly vlogs so or like hopefully the week before maybe two weeks sort of after yeah um, so that means that hopefully the weekend that I move in which is the 9th of September hopefully the Friday after that which is the 15th I should have sort of with like either a weekly vlog or like a weekend vlog um, so yeah, that's kind of the plan, and I know it's a lot of work, but I just think, it really isn't me think about it, especially since the second, second channel videos are, they take less effort, they're less maintenance, and I'm already kind of in the swing of filming main channel videos anyway, so yeah, I think it's going to go well, I think this might be the first year where I actually managed to go through big changes in my life, like I spoke about in Monday's video. Um, without it affecting my YouTube channel too much so I'm really excited and sorting all this out is actually really getting me excited for moving into the house I have literally been talking about it with Harry all morning I'm so excited just to move in um, we haven't bought anything for it yet but when Harry's down Harry comes down next Monday for two weeks um, over those two weeks at some point we're gonna do I think an Ikea and Lakeside trip my mum buy sort of what we need and I'm so excited just to buy like bedding and pillows and things. I can't wait, it's gonna be so good. Right, so I'm gonna crack on with some more work because I've taken a long enough break. Um, I'm just gonna time lapse this, so I hope you enjoy my day of doing nothing. So 
I just finished eating, I just made some fresh pasta because I realised I hadn't really eaten anything proper today, I just had breakfast this morning, which was just uh, cereal, so I think I should probably eat something since it's kind of late now, it's like, uh, it's nearly three o'clock, so yeah, um, what I think I'm going to do is <clears throat> wrap up here, maybe come back into it later, start getting ready and film a couple of videos, I think I might try and film one mystery video and then two, hopefully two, maybe two, second channel videos, um, the Monday videos I was talking about, if not, I might film one of those and maybe one uh, Wednesday video for my main channel, which is a haul, hopefully, so, yes, I think I'm going to go get ready and again I'll probably just time lapse that because it's the easiest thing to do, so yeah. Right, so it's about quarter to five now. The light is still really good, so thank God for summer lighting. Um, I'm all ready. My camera's all set up, everything. I needed to put my camera battery, where is it? On charge, that's charging. I think I'm gonna, um, I'm cooking dinner tonight, so I'll probably start cooking dinner at about half five. <clears throat> so I think that means I'll probably get one video filmed in a second. And I think that may be a, um, second channel video 19 things i learned by 19 years and then after dinner i think i'm gonna film the mystery video and if the lighting is good then hopefully the third video i wanted to film if not i'll film that tomorrow morning before i go out so it's the next day we are it's me and bug we're going into town jake's just doing a few bits and i'm going to meet alex so yes So I don't know how well you can see it all in right now, but um, just walking home from town, I just had a really nice day with Alex, I can't remember what the last game was I filmed, we just went and got a few bits because Alex is going back to uni on Friday, so we went to Primark and like Wilco and things just to get some home bits, and then we sat and had a customer and had a chat, oh I think we filmed in Nando's, so we had some lunch, so yeah I got a few, actually just a couple bits in Primark. So I might show you those when I get home, or I might add them to my whole world, I don't know. I'm really not feeling good today, guys. But, how am through? I've got some strawberries from M&S, so I'm just literally going to go up and eat them all. Okay, so it's a little bit later now. <coughs> Sorry. I'm on my way back into town because I'm meeting Alex again. I'm going to go out. Yeah, it's just, it's Wednesday night and it's karaoke night in Yates, and we're going to go chill for a bit, just before she goes back to uni, so it's just me and her tonight, so yeah. Hey guys, so it's Thursday morning, and it's actually results day today for GCSE and A-level students, so if you get your results today, I hope everything went okay. Um, I tweeted out saying just sort of, hope everything's going okay for everyone, and just sort of remember, like no matter what happens, you'll always have options, so yeah. Um, this morning we actually went out for breakfast after my brother Jake opened his AS results. Um, I have a photo of it, I'll put it in the photo here. I forgot to take a video clip. I just have not been feeling well, like, whatever this illness is, it's not going away. And it's just sort of lingering and getting worse, so it's nearly been two weeks now. Um, I've had it and t yesterday and today it's become nausea, so I just feel really ill. So, uh, mum and Jake have gone out, they dropped me off on the way. So yeah, I'm just filling up a hot water bottle because I'm having really bad period pains. So just sort of let you guys know that. But yeah, I'm gonna film, chill for a bit, then film. Um, yeah. So I'm just lying here with my hot water bottle under my shirt. It's under my like trackies and my shirt. Sorry, my bed's a mess. 
I'm just going to chill here for a bit. I think I might do some online sort of window shopping to have a look, see what stationery I need to buy, like, for uni, because it's three weeks on Saturday, which is still quite a while, but um, I don't have a lot of money. <laughs> so I need to, like, gradually buy things so I'm not all of a sudden broke. So I think I might sort of work out um, the remainder of the stationery bits I need to get. Um, and then I'm going to film a stationery haul because I love stationery. Hey guys, so it's Friday and I forgot to sort of end yesterday just because I, I literally went to bed early. I felt really bad. This morning I feel a lot better. We went to Starbucks this morning with family and we're now just on our way to the park. So yeah, it's just a chill morning. I don't even know what time it is. I think it must be like 12 maybe. So yeah. It's about half past five now and I have literally just been smashing work so I have filmed, well, I, I'd already had a few videos from just in the past few days, like I think I filmed one yesterday when I wasn't, yeah I filmed one yesterday when I wasn't feeling great, basically I filmed, I'd already filmed two uh, coffee chat videos, so for this Monday coming, the Monday after, so coffee chat two and three. I filmed those just to get those um, up and sorted while I could because Harry's coming down on Monday and I know I'm not going to have as much like just chilling time because obviously we'll be doing stuff so I have those up. Um, I have exported and uploaded Coffee Chat 3 because it was only about 3 minutes long but Coffee Chat number 2 is going to take about 7 hours to export just because it's about a 15 minute video that's just my laptop because I do so much work on this laptop, bless it, it's just, it has to kick out so much, well, yeah, anyway, so I've done that, um, I uploaded, I just did uploaded Sundays from the studio last night, and after this export in about eight hours, <laughs> seven and a half hours, is done, I'm hoping to start putting together the vlog clips for this, so that's sort of created as a product on my laptop, and yeah, I've also been organising all my weeks. Um, I started it the other day as I filmed, but I've just coming up with some more solid plans for Wednesday videos because Wednesday ones are the hardest to plan ahead because they're the ones that are like time dependent and also like they're the ones that if brands want a video a certain day, like if I do a sponsorship deal or like I have to allocate, allocate weeks. Um, just in case I do, I don't know, like a Primark haul, then obviously I want that up that week, so, yeah, I've been, I've had, I've been able to sort of have a few more videos planned, so pretty much I have videos planned up until, like, def definitive videos planned up until Sunday the 3rd of September, that's like two weeks, three weeks including this week, but that's all sorted, um, <clears throat> So ideally, hopefully tomorrow and Sunday, I'd also like to get the following week, so the week beginning Monday, Monday the 4th of September to, Mo to Sunday the 10th, I'd ideally like to have those mostly filmed um, and edited because that is the week I will be moving in to uni and then ideally as well, so sort of over the coming two weeks, I would like to have the following week after that, so the first week I'm at uni, so the 11th to the 17th, have that filmed as well and so on so I'd like to sort of constantly be like a week or so ahead of myself because I know I've been to uni before it's not gonna be like last time but I am still gonna need a little bit of time to settle in and everything get everything sorted the room sorted and everything like obviously I want to do a room tour but I'll have to do that sort of once I've sorted myself but yeah that's all very good I'm very happy also going I'm just editing um coffee chat three and two and three's thumbnails now so I can have those ready and then I'm going to just um, do a bunch of research for some mystery reviews. So yeah, all very good in Caitlin's world. She, I'm feeling a lot better now. And I can smell my dinner cooking. So, so yeah, productive Caitlin is back. Hey guys, so it's Saturday and I'm once again sat at my dining room table. 
yeah, I'm just doing work again. I have had a really chill morning, just sort of slowly doing work. I edited, I've put together like the vlog footage. It's like 20 to 2 now. So I've literally just been working all day. Like I said, it's been pretty chill because I try not to, like, I've been working pretty hard this week. Um, I try not to burn out. So yeah, I'm just getting a bunch sorted ready for these next few weeks. I had a few requests recently to do some more sort of UK based uh, mystery videos because um, to, to be fair, typically when I do my research, like just more American ones come up because obviously it's a much bigger place, it's a lot more, but um, I've been looking into some more sort of UK based ones because a lot of you are from the UK I think and it's quite, you know, interesting. So I've got a list here of, I'm, I'm just going to create like a page of potential UK mysteries to talk about and then do sort of like further research into them when the time comes but it means that for future weeks if I ever run out of sort of research I can just look at this list and go search the name specifically rather than just having to do like research from the get-go so let me know um, some specific media um, uh, some specific I can't speak <laughs> let me know some specific mystery cases you want me to discuss try I'm, I'm gonna try not to do like the mainstream ones so like obviously I have John Benet Ramsey written down um so just try and avoid sort of the mainstream ones because obviously a lot of people have already requested them like you know Madeleine McCann and things just if you have any sort of out of the box then that would be great um especially ones that haven't already been done by other like mystery youtubers so yeah just gonna do some more of those I was thinking initially for Coffee Chat Room before to do some sort of um, relationship video which I know sounds really weird but I get a lot of questions um, and sort of like advice for you so if you have like relationship questions either about my relationship like because I was going to do sort of a bit on long distance because we are technically temporarily long distance and meeting at uni and things if you want me to do like a specific Q&A not just on my relationship but like on anything in general I might do that for this one also like relationships in uni, I was going to talk about maybe like um, the alleged hookup culture to do with uni so if there's anything like that you want me to answer then you can either DM me or leave it in the comments and then for number five I was going to do um, something to do with friendships because again I get a lot of questions on school friendships like advice and unis and things like that like staying friends with people at, uni, at home when you go to uni and I have quite a lot to say about friendships because I have had quite a few experiences. So I was thinking of doing like a fake friendships versus real friendships and like advice on how to stay in contact with your friends and stuff when you go to uni and whatnot, things like that. And then number six, which I haven't written down here, I was thinking of doing some sort of living away from home, like what it's really like video. But yeah, that's just a little sneak peek of what I was planning for my coffee chats. If you have a specific topic or if there's like something within those videos you'd like me to discuss just like specify down below if it's um in one of those videos so like just say oh can you talk about this in the friendships video um then leave that down below and also if you just want if you have like a specific topic for a new coffee chat video that you want me to do then i can definitely do that because coffee chat ones always going to be looking for topics to talk about um so yeah if you have anything you'd like me to discuss or just questions i might just do a q a one at some point so yeah i've also realized that this summer and kind of just like recently i haven't done as many hauls as i usually do because um i've been saving a lot more money just for uni prep and things um pretty much for this upcoming few weeks so i can buy things that i need for uni so that does mean that there may be a few hauls that are consecutive on wednesday uploads which i hope you guys don't mind i love watching hauls to be fair but i'm thinking i might just upload more because I'm not going to do specific like uni homeware hauls like I did last year because I'm pretty much just using the majority of the stuff that I took last year. So as long as you guys don't mind um, like more hauls then it's fine. I haven't done them in a while. I've been really talking in this video. I did. I think I did preface this vlog that it was going to be like a pretty boring one because it's just a lot of me working this week. Um, yeah. Oh, I just realized I stole 
my sunglasses and I'm inside. Hey guys, so it's Sunday and I have just gotten back. This morning we literally just kind of got up and went out because it's Sunday, so we wanted to go to Sainsbury's. We needed to pick up a few bits before it got busy and then pop around to my grandparents and just sort of um, had a chat with them for a little while. So I didn't really vlog this morning, but I'll just show you what I bought in Sainsbury's. It's not very exciting. Um, I need a new moisturiser because I ran out of my favourite one from Superdrug. It's like one of the, I think I talked about it um, in a video before. It's a tea tree with berry one and also I have really oily skin. So yeah, but I wanted to try more of a creamy one because that was like a gel. So I just got the simple light one. Um, there was a rich one, but I thought that was probably quite heavy for my skin since it's oily. And then I also ran out of micellar water. So got me usual. Um, I avoided buying a big bottle like this last time I needed a micellar water because none of them seemed to be reduced but that one was reduced to three pounds so I was happy to buy a big one because I know that will last me and also I bought a new nail polish because I'm going to redo my nails today usually when you get acrylics done you sort of leave it like a lot more time than I do like I've had this on for about two weeks now but um, it's more so I just want to get practice so at the moment I have this sort of Primark one on which is like a dark brown you need which I love but I'm going to put this one on which looks kind of white but it's um it's like a, just a pale pink it's a Rita Ora one it's called Fit for a Princess it was reduced to two pounds so I'm gonna be putting that on later I think because why not I'm gonna pick up like I'm going to Lakeside and Ikea on Wednesday when Harry's down with my family to get sort of some uni bits so I want to buy some more like Primark nail polishes there because they're so so good quality for a pound um and i don't want to faff about with like matte ones or anything because acrylic nails i prefer just them looking shiny so i'm just gonna spend like a couple like uh, probably like a fiver on like different kind of nail polishes so i have some so yes um i'm just going to sort out my room it's a bit mad at the moment because obviously i'm sort of half getting ready to move everything and also harry's come down so um, I keep saying Harry's coming down, but he is, <laughs> and I need to clear a bit of space for him. So the aim is to, I don't know how you can see, it's a bit of a mess at the moment. Um, I've got a mini chest of drawers here, three drawers, that I want to clear out eventually and put in these boxes. I have these big old tubs here, there's four, two of them are on the top inside each other, and this just has some towels and things that I need to just tuck in there out of the way, and the other two are filled. So I'm going to go through, there's four of them, and ideally I want to go through them all, allocate a box for things, and gradually start packing everything away for uni. I have got three weeks, but it's more things like books or makeup bits and stuff that I don't necessarily need um, out immediately. Um, basically everything in my room but clothes, because my clothes are just going to go in my suitcases the last week. So yeah, I'm just going to do that now, and then I'm going to do my nails. Or I'm going to do my nails first, actually. I don't know. I'll see. Hey guys, so it's quite a bit late now, it's probably I think it's around 8 o'clock. Just thought I'd give you guys an update since I've been working like all day on this room. So <laughs> I'm shattered. Um emptied two of those drawers ready for Harry and also filled the four boxes like I said I was gonna. So this bottom one isn't coming with me to uni, this is stuff that's staying here, that's just out of the way at the moment, and then these three ones are coming with me. This one is sort of stuff that I'm using my notebooks makeup daily makeup for the next few weeks and no daily makeup and skincare back there are some books that are staying and yeah so i'm pretty much done actually the, the only thing really left that needs to be organized is my clothes and i also redid my nails um which took a little while so yeah um i think i'm just gonna end this vlog here because it's quite a long one i'm gonna put all this together and edit it and upload it really for friday and i'll have a new vlog starting tomorrow so thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys soon for another video.